Hey, what's up guys? This is Golden Eye Ponich bringing you guys another installment to my series, quote unquote, playing, where I take random elements of the game Call of Duty Black Ops and I play them, give you guys some tips and tricks and stuff like that. So today I am bringing you my playing as a sniper, basically. It's using a sniper rifle, playing smart with it, doing all that jazz. So we're playing some team deathmatch on the map jungle and as you guys will see in this gameplay it's actually pretty funny well first first of all here i got hackers so i go around destroy a couple of claymores you'll see at the beginning hacker has actually become a really really useful perk for me i use it a lot because i always used to get killed by claymores and stuff and you see here i'm just running around destroying everything which it helps my team as well as myself uh, be more successful destroys the other team's equipment which is obviously good but you'll see in this gameplay that the entire other team is a sniping clan so I had my work cut out for me they were like talking smack in the lobby I was like you know what whatever and this was actually kind of a fluke gameplay I didn't really expect to do well in this game I just basically now uh, I've been liking sniping a lot more now that I've figured out that the PSG one is actually a really really useful sniper I at least in my hands it's more accurate it's quicker because of the um, well it doesn't have recoil like the L96 you really need to account for lag and stuff but for the PSG one I found that it's much more useful and I can I don't know do better with it so anytime I get on a sniping map now I just choose to use a sniper so jungle came up and I threw that PSG one on beautiful olive camo got my C4 my tomahawks my concussions uh, and I'm using steady aim I know that because I always use steady aim with snipers I'm using uh, hacker obviously and then lightweight pro I think but yeah, so I come up on the bridge here, grab that other guy off the bridge, and this was actually a pretty decent gameplay for me, considering, I don't know, I'm not the best at, at this game still. I've been doing a lot better lately because I've been working on it, I've been trying to get better, trying to play more smart, more tactically, get, uh, like, actually think about what I'm doing. Because before that, I just ran around with the rent of stuff, and I died there, unfortunately. But yeah, I got lightweight pro, city aim, and hacker. Neither of them are pro. But yeah, I've been playing a lot better lately. This score comes out to about 18 and 5. I die one or two before the chopper gunner, which makes me extremely angry. Angry that seems to always happen to me. But that's what goes. <laughs> That's what happens because I get all nervous and stuff and then I end, up, I end up like missing my shots or getting killed from behind or something. Look at this. Look at this right here. What do I do? Oh, no. They ran away. But you'll see by the end of the gameplay the other team only has two people because I actually make the other sniping clan rage quit. So I think that was pretty cool and funny. But I just grabbed... Oh, double quick scope. Ah, well, that was a drag scope. But still, it was pretty sweet. And pick up the PSG Marksman 1 achievement and I'm actually just running around in this gameplay I, I'm not really doing anything smart other than I don't know playing well really this was just oh I found that quick scoping isn't the ideal thing to do like if you can what I like to do is I like to scope in pretty quick like you'll see me doing there and uh, take a breath for a second or like hold my breath for a second to steady my shot up and then pull that off like see like that because I found that quick scoping just it's too inaccurate and it, it doesn't really benefit you if you're not going to hit any of the shots but by taking that extra split second to scope in you're going to hit 10 times as many shots and that's obviously going to be good in the long run so right here I'm at 7 kills, I need 9 for the chopper, and I die pretty soon, which is aggravating, <laughs> but oh well, it happens. And yeah, I really didn't expect to 
get like a napalm strike or anything because this is I'm using a sniper and just running around so this was really surprising to me so right when I finished this gameplay actually I oh see I got killed from behind right when I finished this I just stuck it in my file share thinking that maybe I could use it and thanks again to Mr. Zebraman010 for recording this he has been really nice about recording all my gameplays for me and hopefully they look beautiful I think they do because it's HD PVR quality you know how it is but yeah so I picked up three kills with the napalm there that was pretty useful actually and I'm just watching down there because I know a lot of people go down uh, that way unfortunately this was a team deathmatch so there's really nowhere for me to go it was kind of slow paced because there's nothing for me to do like if I'm playing domination or whatever I can at least run to B flag or C flag and know that there are either going to be people spawning there or people running there so that I can pick them off but this was just a regular TDM so I didn't really know what I, where I was going I was just running around trying to find people really that's the, the base of this game mode is running around trying to get kills and stuff but I am oh look at this boss Oh, threw that thing headshot. Wow, you thought you were going prone and get. Oh, get out of here, good sir. <laughs> but yeah, so I got that other spy plane up. Oh, my kill streaks are spy plane napalm and chopper gunner. If you guys were wondering. And yeah, so pretty pro gameplay. It's winding down here. You guys will see. It just starts to go really slowly. I don't know how many kills I'm at right now. Uh, let's see 17 so uh, within the next like th two minutes I only get one more kill my final score is 18 and 5 which doesn't sound amazing but it's not too shabby I guess because I'm not the best sniper I've been working on it, though so we'll just have to see but yeah guys so hopefully you guys did enjoy I'm just gonna fast forward up this ending and then I will see you guys later. So, as always, thank you for tuning in, and I will see you next time. Well done.